Hello there! Welcome to Sweden. Wait a minute. That's not right. That's better. Welcome to Sweden. We've just landed in Stockholm and we are about to see my parents and I am about to pee myself out of excitement. I haven't seen them for over a year and I'm just ooh, I'm so excited that we're here. Welcome to Sverige. Uh, jag pratar inte svenska. No, I'm just joking. I don't speak Swedish. Oh my gosh, it's sun. Oh, now I feel like a typical Swede. Alrighty, so we've been in Stockholm one week now. I think our bodies are finally used to the winter. We're not jet lagged anymore. And uh, yeah, we're just starting to get settled in. That's what I can say about Stockholm. Some initial observations. Number one, it's an absolutely beautiful city. It's really clean. Uh, they love their recycling here, so the recycling doesn't just go into one yellow bin, it goes into all sorts of different bins. Um, so very clean. Uh, the metro station is really easy. There's only three lines, so you just get there and they come every like two minutes. So train is really easy. So that's nice. The people are interesting. Really, hmm, how can I describe them? They keep to themselves the Swedes. So it's not like in Australia where you go to the the shopkeeper or someone at the bus station, you go, how are you going? And you just, hey, hey, and that's it. There's no real small talk in Sweden. So I'm gonna try and break them. I'm gonna see if I can change that habit. What else? It's obviously very cold. Actually, that's a funny thing. The Swedes love to talk about the weather all the time. Like, for me, I'm here, I understand that it's cold. I mean, it's snowing. And I've come to terms with it. I don't have to, oh, and I might be a bit snotty. I've come to terms with the fact that it's very cold, so I don't think about it all the time, and I certainly don't talk about it all the time. But whenever you meet a Swede, the first thing they talk about is the weather. Actually, the people, when they're walking, they're always walking very efficiently in the right lane, you know, left or right. And um, when they're lining up for things, whether it's going up the stairs or an elevator or coming out of the train, they always leave the exact right amount of room between one another. They don't get in each other's personal space. it is. What time is it Robbie? It's four o'clock in the afternoon. It's four o'clock in the afternoon and it is pitch black. This is a uh, classic Sweden. Classic. Welcome to my country. 